To perform the two-handed clean and press, you can use a bell or a dumbbell. I'll demonstrate using both, just in case you don't have one or the other. So, we'll set up with our feet directly uh, about shoulder width apart. We'll have the bell directly in between, right by our ankles. We'll first start off by the two-handed clean. So drive through the hips, around the hand, allow the hands to move around the horns of the bell. And then from here, press straight up above our head. Keeping those ribs pulled down, not arching through the back. Tuck the hips. Allow the bell to come down, bring it back down. Drive through the hips, hands move around the bell, press it up above your head, bring it back down. One more time. Drive through the hips, pause, press. Bring it back down. Now. If you do not have a kettlebell available to you, you can perform the same exercise using the dumbbell. The way we're going to do it though, we're gonna change it a little bit. We're gonna have our hands on end, so on the two ends of the dumbbell. We'll have the hips and feet about hip width apart, sorry, the feet about hip width apart. You'll take the bell directly in between the knees, drive through the hips, keep the bell close to the body from here. Press above your head. Bring it back down, elbow stand. Bell comes down. Drive through the hips. Press it up. Back down. Drive through the hips. Elbow in. Press it up. Back down. And that is how you will perform the two-handed clean and press.